Okay, but uh, it's Texas where we are. Oh, uh, we don't, we cannot guarantee it's gonna stay. <laughs> True story. But that's okay, we're really excited about fall. So, however, our wardrobe isn't very exciting about fall because I literally have nothing in my closet that fits me for colder weather. So as soon as the cold front came in, I was like, time to go back to the thrift store. Today we're fall shopping at the thrift store, finding super cute deals. Now we went on a 50 cent day, so we're just at the one thrift store. We're not really comparing, but we wanted to show you some of the fun things that are out there to motivate you to go find some cool thing at the thrift store and add to your wardrobe this fall. Right, so one of the first things is what we're actually wearing today. Oh. Yay! Oh. So we're both kind of layered up because, you know, it's Texas, the sun could come out and it can turn into 80 degrees in the next two hours. So, so true. got my long sleeve white undershirt and my long sleeve sweater over it, which, you know, isn't really a layer because I get really warm all the time. So when I layer, my second layer is always a fake layer. This is a perfect fake layer for me because <laughs> it looks so warm and comfy and cozy and I'm not warm at all. So the fun thing about Tiffany is she generally runs hot anyways, so she loves fall, but her body temperature doesn't. So she needs things that she can definitely stay cool while it's starting to cool off because right. we're, we still warm up. Or you go into somebody's house and the heater's blasting oh and you're like, oh my goodness, I'm melting. Oh. Why? It's beautiful. Let's be a little cold. Right. Why do I have a sweater if I don't get to wear it? Dang it. Right. I'm never needing a scarf if you keep your heater on. My house was so cold this morning. It was beautiful. The kids are like, can we have hot chocolate? Yes. Yes. My kids are like, it feels like Christmas. <laughs> it's been too hot. Okay. They forgot. They're poor little thin blood doesn't know what to do with it. Right, day one it's like what 70? Is yeah, it's gonna be the 70s today and they're We did get down frozen. to 50s last night. It was cold. And I we opened up all the windows in our house. It was awesome. Yeah I'm not that mean. It was just nice and cool in my house. Anyway. Alright so let's just dive in and so what else? So today we thought we're not just gonna hold up hangers because that's no fun and we're way excited. Alright so here's our little sporty fun long sleeves is a little bit of like fall coloring. Charlotte's sporting an awesome hoodie on the back of hers. I'm like, check out my little hood. Right. So I have to tell you, I found that. I put it in the cart for me. But we are nice when we try on clothes. We like put them on over our shirts at the thrift store in the back corner. Well, the one we go to doesn't have a dressing room. Not, not, have not that. <laughs> not that we can really go in dressing rooms right. in many places. Anyways. There's no bar. So, but we are at least nice to each other to be like, all right, I'll be honest. That one like lays on you nicer than it lays on me. I'm still a little roundish to fit into a medium all the time. So well, she rocked that one. So I was like, take it out. I'm, I'm grateful. So we, we often benefit from each other's finds. Yes. So I totally benefited. I was like, oh, yay, I could look like a teenager. So she, she picked it up and was like, are you ever going to be an adult again? And now I'm the one who gets to be a teenager. Oh my gosh, you don't really make fun of me for picking that up. I remember. I did. But yeah. it was super cute. <laughs> so I should have been like, no, it's for my teenage daughter. And not tell you it was for me. <laughs> what but anyway, it was for you. No, no, this is my baseball shirt. Yes, look how cute she is. I don't know. I like the colored sleeves. It gives something different. It's comfy, it's not like too snug and fitting, so I get to lounge and not have to worry about love handles. <laughs> you know, because we're never perfect, so it's yeah. nice to be comfy sometimes. And, right, so hey, cute. I get cold a lot easier than she does too, and my hands can warm up now. True story. Alright, so this was our next find, so wait until we get it. Alright, so here's a little bit more winter Christmassy, I think. Plaid, I think, yeah. definitely makes me feel Christmassy. I know. So, and then this is my deer shirt. I thought it was way cute. I've seen them on like all the Pinterest girls with their like jeggings and their boots. You're a Pinterest girl now! Almost, almost! Oh, I'm still wearing jeans, cute. but I'm getting there. <laughs> so, anyway, so that's how I was like, oh, it's a striped deer shirt. It totally reminds me of like a winter cabin y experience. Yes. So I was like, Tiffany, Tiffany, it's perfect. I know, I'm so excited. So, and then you and your awesome plaid. Okay, so I. I love plaid, and then my daughter, I'm like, that's where she gets it from. I bought her plaid, and now she's obsessed. So I guess that's how our kids work sometimes. Sometimes right. they rebel against what we love. My daughter's taken it to be her core of all meaning and existence. And nobody else can have it now. Nobody. <laughs> However, I didn't even show my girls this shirt because I loved it. I was like, my gray plaid shirt. Right. And so I feel at home. I'm like, oh, this is me. Right? And it's got like a little line of just pink. Just a little bit. It. Just yeah. a little bit, to, so it's not just gray. Yeah, it's kind of fun. So. I love it. I love jackets so much! Okay, she seriously has a problem with jackets. For years! When we go to the thrift store in the summer, 
she's finding the jacket. All the time. All and the time. rewind, remember how I'm never cold? Never <laughs> cold! So I never wear jackets. <laughs> so she has a lot of them that she never wears. However, now she has no jackets. <laughs> right. But it is going to be colder, so she does. And you might get colder this year. I hope I get a little bit colder this year. So this was the black plaid that my girls were fighting over before it's I even so opened cute. up. It looks so good on her, I couldn't even ask to try it on. I was like, oh my gosh, that looks so good. I wouldn't have let her, because I loved it. But anyway, so I was super excited. It's got the cute belt. It was all oh, there. I love it. All the buttons were being a thrift store find. Like, there was absolutely nothing wrong with the gorgeous jacket. Yes. Super happy. And even just like the simple white shirt I have on again, mm -hmm. a black shirt, a blue shirt. If I was crazy, I could even wear the sparkly blue sweater with this in layer three times. I would never. But it would look cute. <laughs> she could totally work it. Right? Okay, now let's pull out some more earthy tones that look amazing on Charlotte, even though she's like never worn them before. I love this color, especially as the jacket though. Yes. Super cute. Adds that kind of like layering with the like pockets and the buttons. Yes. So I feel like I'm like dressing it up a little bit. I know, it's got so much dimension to it and I love the collar. Yeah. And it has, it's still stiff and stands upright and stuff like that. It's awesome. It's always important. Yep. So important. So I'm just like super happy with our jacket finds at the thrift store. I, I tell you, I have never been disappointed. I don't know what you people do when you buy jackets that are expensive. And these are both Old Navy jackets. Yes. Uh, yeah, so I was like, I don't know. You buy them and wear them for never like I do and then donate them. Thanks, appreciate it. Because then they go in my closet. All right, so Tiffany's so, going to do a turn for us. All right. Woo. All right. And then this is my khaki one too, but it's a lot lighter than Charla's. Which is also very appropriate for her. <laughs> right. Right, it's thinner, a lot thinner, but it still has the cute tie. It zips, I can fasten it all the way. We check the zipper, super fun. It's got the cute little drop. Yeah. So, all right, so here's my other jacket button. That's super awesome. Yeah, we can totally twin now. Oh, look at us, because we don't do enough things alike that no, we get to match all the time. Sometimes you just have to match. Sometimes we do it on accident, and people probably look at us like we're weirdos. I just love when, like, we pretend we're twins and people are like, you know you don't look alike, right? <laughs> right. At all. At all! That's okay, that's a good thing, because we're not the same person even though we act like. Pretty much. Alright, let's check out what you had next to go over. Okay, so I'm gonna take off my jacket, and one of my favorite things that I found is a nice undershirt, which is still super fall-like, and it has like super cute sleeves. There you go. So, often, like we talked about layering is really handy, when we go outside or we're out running around, it's nice to have the jacket, but when we go inside, it's usually, people have the heater on. You're one of those 80 degree housers in the wintertime, we can't be friends. Anyways, so when we get into your house and we're kind of hot, I can just totally take off the jacket and I have a nice short sleeve, comfortable shirt to where I'm not melting, and yet I still feel super cute and fall-like. I've never seen a shirt like that. I know, me neither. I was like, it's so cute. I think Tiffany found it. So I did. Thank you. You're welcome. And this is our comfy, like, house cute sweater. This where you can really tell, like, our difference between comfy and Miss <laughs> Charlotte's still And this is just the here. different things we found, too. Yes. And so there was some really cute um, crochet type things. So this is the other one I ended up with. But it's like a little dressy, so I could wear it out to church or when I want to look a little nicer. Um, but at the same time, if I get warm again, this is an easy thing to take off and unlayer if I need to. It like matches that shirt also. Awesome. It's so nice. <laughs> I was like, I'm super coordinated today. Uh, you are. I was like, wow, that's like almost the same color. It really is, really but just different tone. Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. All right, so then this is my boyfriend sweater, old navy like hoodie that they do. So it's just really big and loose and comfy and it just hangs on me nicely and I get to just kind of lounge in it and I can run to the store and still not be frumpy but comfy. That's the important part. That's what I'm learning. Frumpy and comfy. Two different things. And yes. I just want to be comfy and not necessarily frumpy all the time. So, yeah. these are our amazing fall finds and we're not done yet. I was already planning. I want to go back and I want to maybe go on like $2 day to look for jeans and I want a couple more sweaters or jackets because I love them so much and I have none in my room now. Well, besides these to... three. <laughs> yeah, besides these three. <laughs> so it's fun to go and pick up just a few things and not spend a lot of money. And that's partly why we love thrift store shopping. So speaking of picking a bunch of things up. Okay, when I come home, when we came home, we had two big yellow bags. <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, hauling them like in like trash, Santa kitchen bags. trash bags, yes. Okay, but what I do when I'm done, and Tiffany does the same thing, yeah. is we go through our closet. 
and we re-donate just maybe to other stores, but I don't keep everything. There's a point to keeping it going. So the challenge to you guys, if you're going to go out there, go through your closets and decide what you're not really wearing anymore. Some of the hardest parts is I get, I'm back down into a size of some of the clothes that I haven't been able to wear, which feels really good. And yet at the same time, maybe these clothes aren't really the ones I love anymore. And that's okay too. So it's been really nice to go through and take away some of these old things, old memories, and be able to build some new ones. Yep. So that's the way we do it. Like one for one sometimes. So keep the cycle going, help out your community, donate to your thrift stores, and shop from your thrift stores. There you go. We'll see you next time on Stupid Useful, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and be sure to comment on anything you liked or anything you found too. Yeah, so today we're back st Today we're back to fall shopping. Okay, that didn't work. Back to school. That doesn't work. We're not going to do it by school. Okay, so today we're back. Oh, someone say back in there. No back, no back. There's no back. Okay. Stick up the boobs. Don't worry, I'm recording that right now. I know you are.